Can I play Kate Beckett? I'm the New York police detective. <laughs> Just turn the top. <laughs> and I'm Richard Castle, a murder mystery novelist who gets, lost his mojo. Yeah, and I get to collaborate with with Kate you Beckett. on a case because someone's copycatting the, the murders, murders from that my he's books. Written. There you have it. He kind of weasels his way into my world via the mayor, who's a good friend of his, and, then and the Kate two of us becomes the new muse for my new series of novels. So this is a novel that Richard Castle is actually writing in the show. Mm -hmm. It's going to come out right away. And he uses it as an excuse to be wa uh, to be following her, right? Right, because it's good press for the NYPD. Totally yeah, right. Is. Totally. Is. He secretly has a crush on her. There's that too. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and then we're actually going to write the, this. This book has actually been written. Richard Castle's n Heat Wave, mm -hmm. with, the, with the character Nikki Heat, is going to be on bookshelves. Is a real book that'll be out there, and Nathan Fillion is going to go out there and sign it. I just don't know whether to sign Richard Castle or Nathan Fillion. Mm -hmm. We left last season on a huge cliff cliffhanger. That becomes kind of a sore spot because that's. Beckett said, "Don't go there. Yeah. Don't dig into my mom's murder." And Richard doesn't know where to stop. Right. Doesn't know when to shut up. He means well, he just doesn't... Uh. Doing the right things for the wrong reasons? Yeah. How'd you prepare, my friend? Well, I did a lot of ride-alongs with NYPD and <laughs> LAPD. No, wait, that was you. <laughs> I went on the ride-alongs with LAPD and NYPD. And I, I, I spent a day with Stephen Cannell at his house Super in Sprawling cool. Estate really? in Pasadena. You didn't tell me this. So How was it? He's so fashionable. And fun, by He's the so way. fashionable. Let me talk about a car collection. One no. All the way down. Like I know. That. I saw a couple on set. It was really wow. cool. We're going to do a bunch of poker <clears throat> scenes with um, the writers this, this season, too, which will be neat. Mm -hmm. Did you rough up any suspects? <laughs> talk. Um, <laughs> you will talk. Uh, you know, it, it, was really, it was really revealing in that they told me how important it was to lock down a case and make sure that it was really rock solid. Um, because once it gets to the court, they can't afford to have it fall apart because there was one element that was missing or one thing wasn't tested properly, whatever it is. Um, that was really interesting because Kate is kind of uh, a stickler in the way that she's developing her cases, whereas Castle is super creative. He comes from the other angle where it's kind of like free for all. He can, he can start from the ending and then head backwards. Um, and so I understood why she was rigid in her way of um, developing a case and establishing all of the proof parts. She needed to make sure that there's no way that that case could be broken down because the criminals need to be put to justice in the end. Are we going to hook up? Yes, we will hook up Episode eventually. Mm. No, I mean eventually. <laughs> That's something you want to jump into. I think we all understand that this what makes our show charming is that there's this wonderful delicate dance going on mm -hmm. that, that people are really enjoying, uh, myself included. So if we were to, you know, hook up right away, I think that would be an obvious kind of... Yeah. We still have a lot to learn about each other. Our characters still have a lot to kind of overcome and find out. My character is still uh, being unpeeled, so to speak. Mm -hmm. Don't you think when people get together, people that know they're, go they're gonna get together, they take their time. Yeah, there's no rush. Why go there right? until, you until you're ready, mm -hmm. until it's, it's all marinated well. And then sometimes life throws hurdles in their way, and mm -hmm. you have to kind of overcome these obstacles mm -hmm. in order to kind of remain together in some way, shape, or form. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's reality. Yep.